India is on the move, fast integrating with the world economy. However, the foundation of India's democracy lies in its people, their efforts to improve the quality of life and their determination to fight injustice. He is very angry because the electricity connection to his farm was cut off by people whom he refused to bribe. His crop got destroyed and now he wants to know why should he suffer. Sita's complaint is that there is a water problem in her village. These determined men and women have come to the problem-solving camp to protest against delays in the implementation of projects. Ghevar Singh has come with 60 other residents to demand the posting of a teacher and a bus connection. Or, he thunders, we will lock the school and jam the road. A recent phenomenon, these camps, attended by officials and the elected representatives of the people, aim to redress people's grievances. These camps indicate a change in the attitude of the bureaucrats and the politicians, who are realizing the value of transparency. Villagers in Rajasthan have also stepped up their demand for the right to information about funds earmarked for development. But not everyone is able to demand information. Centuries of poverty and backwardness have prevented people from fighting for their rights. However, their entry into the world of letters was like piercing the vicious circle of illiteracy, poverty and deprivation. The villagers now know that the solution to their problems is not staying dependent on the government, but to develop a self-reliant system through their own initiative and enterprise. The winds of change, unleashed by the national literacy movement, has brought about a craving for more knowledge. Merely starting a dairy cooperative to earn more is not enough. Imbibing new technology, they have set up computerized fat testing equipment to get a better price for better quality milk. Similarly, a better crop has been possible for farmers like Sadhana, who now use good quality seeds and fertilizers. The thrust of the new continuing education program in India is the setting up of community learning centers in every village. The learning centers serve as a vibrant meeting place for villagers, exchanging information, enriching their knowledge base, and getting ideas on income generation projects. Skill development workshops and training programs are also organized. The Didi, or Sisters Bank, run by Jago Behna Samitis in the backward districts of Bihar, encourage women to deposit savings and avail loans when required. These groups of women are also a support to one another in times of distress. Also, neo-literates like this mother and daughter, wanting to pursue learning beyond basic literacy to acquire qualifications equivalent to that available under the formal schooling system, can do so through equivalency programs. The Continuing Education Program is an open-ended and expanding program for lifelong learning. And it is a challenging task. However, the success of the literacy movement so far gives the torchbearers the determination to march onward into the future with confidence.
पढ़ना लिखना सीखो ओ मेहनत करने वालों पढ़ना लिखना सीखो ओ भूख से मरने वालों Nine years ago, we made a commitment, a commitment to teach a hundred million people to read and write, and this was the beginning of a movement, a movement for literacy. मुझे नहीं लगता था कि मैं कभी किसी को पढ़ा पाऊंगी पर इन्हें पढ़ाने के बाद लगा पढ़ाना कोई खास मुश्किल नहीं है द स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ द मिशन आर द हार्ड वर्किंग वॉल्टियर्स इन एवरी विलेज इन एवरी टाउन डेडिकेशन एंड एंथुजियाजम has transformed a national commitment into a people's movement they have walked long distances braved electricity failures even worked without chalk and out of so little have created a learning environment for so many our early days work starts at 9 am and ends at the next day morning that is after 12 pm we are engaged in the hardest work of our lifetime but we enjoy it we love it and we are happy while doing it yen ber vasantha na padichiruken aruvila yekathila paada nadathradhukaga yen veetla edam kuduthu naane palpu pottu patthu pillaiyalukku solli kuduthukittirken padho likho bhai meri behna padho likho ji trainers and volunteers evolve a variety of creative teaching methods rooted in people's life experiences and the local cultural traditions this makes the process of learning more familiar and enjoyable ha theek hai theek hai ha aa bhai ab maine isme se ye kala ko de diye kitne de diye kala ko panch panch to ye panch the benefits of literacy are many from reading sign boards to increased self confidence कर एक नया इतिहास सचाएंगे पढ़ लिख कर इस देश को अक्षर बनाएंगे अंद मुदिया आरती उपना पारवलिया सर्द ना पड़चिक मन एल मंडल अरविंदोल and the struggle must continue oh,